today we are going mushroom hunting and I'm going with Cody here you can see Cody, Ola, Marina and Anton our driver <laughs> we are actually in Polonia this is my hometown and uh, this place is perfect for mushroom hunting because it's surrounded by forest and people say this is a season to pick them so we, we are hoping to find a few maybe Cody later will um, do something with the mushrooms like carpathian soup or um, mushroom risotto yeah so um, we'll see we'll see what we will find Mushroom hunting is one of the most popular pastimes for Ukrainians. Even people who live in big cities will take day trips to forests to pick mushrooms when the season is right. Luckily, we are visiting my family in my hometown, so this ride to the forest only takes about 10 minutes. So we are in the forest already and I uh, found already a few mushrooms, just a few. And um, here is a pretty one. Um, you know that it's good because the top has a, like a spongy text a texture. Um, so you can eat it. Um, I'm not sure how it's called, my mom would know, but I'm sure it's good because we were picking up, uh, when I was a child, we were picking up them. Um, yeah, so let's see what we'll find else, what else we will find. So here we go, I found one. Look how pretty it is and it's covered with the leaves and wood. So we carefully cutting to not cut the root so it may grow up again. See how cute it is? And it goes right into my bucket. Let's go find more. This mushroom is called a, a milk cap. It's actually, well, we don't pick them. But uh, it says that if you cook properly, you can eat them. Um, and if you cut it, it's supposed to have, let's see. Ah, you can see already. It has this white, white milk, you see? This white liquid white milk. It's really bitter. Yeah, that's why we don't take them. It's long to cook and it can be poisoned if you're not cooking it properly but if you know what to do you can also take them so we find a bunch like a nest or family as we call it in ukraine uh, here one this one here's the second one i over there's the third one i already cut like three or four So I found one of the best ones, uh, they're really expensive in Ukraine, it's called white mushroom, you see, I don't know why white, uh, because the cap has kind of brown, brown uh, color and the bottom is white, but they are really like uh, hard and massive, so if you are getting the mushroom and it's a little bit dirty, uh, the best way is to cut uh, the bottom so the whole bucket won't be uh, into 
it won't be dirty, you know, because they're, um, we of course will wash them, but still, you don't want, um, you don't want the dirt into your bucket. So that's how it looks. I would like to mention that many of the mushrooms you have seen in this video are not edible. If you go mushroom hunting, make sure that mushrooms you take are ones you are confident are non-toxic. And I always say, if you are not sure, it's best to leave it on the ground. It looks like we all had a very successful trip mushroom hunting. We each filled our buckets, and then some. Now, we will make our way to a nice picnic spot for some sandwiches and homemade wine. After a long day of mushroom hunting, I'm on my way to grandma's house, so she can tell me what I have collected. Ты их можно жарить, да? Да. Это решетка. Решетка. Вот это тоже, да? Да. Ой. А? <laughs> Может, не все тоже есть. Это решетки. А это что? Это маслята. Видишь, я сейчас возьму. Где это у меня? Вот его. Ага. Грязный. Это пара штучек на ней. Маслята. А ці? Копеньки. То давай все в кучу візьмем. Давай. А що це не Ні-ні, це не опенічка. Це ці. Це рішітка. А рішітка? Це опеньки. Ось тут ще опенічка, опенічка. Все, сфотографірую. А ці великі? А ці великі? А це вже сфотографірували. А що, казати тут? Так, так. Давай цю велику. Давай. Білий гриб. Все? Так. Ну все, і оце польський гриб, так? Угу. Я не знаю, як воно по-правильному кажеться. Що зайчий, по-моєму, кажуть на них, чи що? Польський гриб, нас кажуть. Uh-huh. 